And what I want from you more after you agree that your prophet have sex with the goat. Oh, actually, he's here. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, let us call him. Hey, Nader Ahmed. How are you? Hello. Well, hello, CP. How have you been doing? After all these years, we finally meet. This is very good. I get a chance to meet you. How have you been doing? Thank you. I'm very fine. So what do you want to say to us? Go ahead. Yeah, so, you know, uh, we've been having these wonderful debates on the Bible, Quran, and modern science. Mostly Quran and modern science. But and what? Quran, I have a Quran, and Quran and science? Absolutely. We've been having these discussions and debates, and I have said Christian has been running away from this debate series because he knows that the Quran is in complete harmony with modern science, okay. and there's... Okay, okay. 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 give us one. Give us one. Give us one. Let us not waste time, me and you. So for some reason, your voice is cutting. Well, Let us, give, give me one, give you me one to miracle. Answer. Give me one yep. miracle. Okay, listen, you have to why were you running away from me from this debate? My People said, no, 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 see who's Don't make excuses. We are here. Let us see who is running. Give me a miracle. Let us laugh. Uh, well, here's what I would like to do, uh, Christian Prince. I would like for us to have a public debate on this topic. Uh, in which... Abdul, do you want to debate me or talk to me right uh, now? Until we have that happen, give me the miracle. Everybody will laugh okay. at you. You are, you are playing like a kid. You call me, we you claim, you claim, you can debate me. Here we go. We can do it right now. Why next year? Why next century? Do it right now. Otherwise, you are just a kid wasting my time. So I'm, I'm, I'm listening to you, please. Don't let us speak like a dog. Are you going to debate me right now, okay, or you will never do it? Well, well, first of all, I will give you want me to give you a scientific miracle right now. I can okay. do that, mm -hmm. but I think you should first answer why you are running away from me. Well, answer that to the people. Because the one is running. I'm saying to you, let's do it right now. You said no. It's you who's running. Do okay. it. Go ahead. What I <laughs> let's do let's do ten minutes right now. Friend, no I can give you will be one. Talk. It's a crossfire debate. Everybody will hear us. It's a conversation. Go ahead. Okay. Here's the problem. If we don't have set rules with time limits, friend, things like that, then we're just going to be. It's a free. It's a, it's, a, it's a free. If it's a free boxing match, show me. Aren't you the one who speak? You speak. You know. You play karate and you are good in boxing. Do your boxing. Free boxing match. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'll tell you, Christian Prince, okay. the Don't problem here is friend. what I... Stop, stop making excuses. The rules go for both of us. It's a free, free, free. Say whatever you want. Do whatever you want. Go ahead. But, but I have a very good excuse. My excuse no, from running from you excuse. is this. You are a coward. Okay, let me give you... You are wasting our time. Are you going ah. to debate me or not? Okay, what what I cannot do, Christian Prince, is Are win a shouting match. Me now or not? Howard on the run. Okay, so we're going to talk about one scientific miracle, mm -hmm. and then you're going to agree to debate me later on. Okay, so uh, I, let's do. I, I am agreeing to debate you anytime. Here we go. I'm here with you. Go ahead. Uh, CP, we need a format. We need equal time, and, and we need to don't, share. Don't call me again. You are just a kid. You don't dare even to talk to me. We need a format. What format? Be a man. You, call, you, you are the one who said you want to debate me. You, you keep saying I'm running from you. You are just a kid. You are not even equal to my shoe. You don't even know how to say your prophet name correctly. If I call you right now and I ask you to say your prophet name correctly, do you do? Do you know how to say it? You don't. And you are the one who agree your prophet have sex with the goat. What more I want from you? So either you want to do it now. Don't waste my time. I will call you one more time. Either we do debate now. Don't put rules. No rule for you. No rule for me. Speak as much as you want. Get me busted. Go ahead. Let me call you. Hey. So That hurt my feeling. Do you accept or not? Yes, let's do a debate because I know you'll run away like a coward. So let's just do See? what you want. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, 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 ladder, ladder. Let, let, be, be a man once in your life and talk. Go ahead. Speak as an adult. Go ahead. Okay. What do you want to say to us? Go ahead. Yes, so we're going to do one scientific miracle to okay. prove that the Quran is the truth and you are actually following a demon called Christ. So both the Bible and the Quran actually answers a question on the issue of alcohol. Now, what's very interesting here, there was a study done, I don't have my hmm. desktop, which is shared, I'll show you that study, hmm. but in this study, it showed 
Hmm. That the, that the Quran actually Muslim because of the teachings of the Quran, the Muslim women are fifty times less likely to give a, a baby. Uh, I'm sorry, to give birth to a who has fetal alcohol syndrome. The study said you got to go to the Christians because of the influence of the Bible. So the question tonight, which Christian Prince needs to answer here, hmm. is okay. So the book of the Quran and the Bible, they gave an answer to this question of alcohol. And when we look at the Quranic answer, it is a far superior what answer. Is the, what is the Quran answer? Until now, you will not give me the verse from the Quran, remember. <clears throat> we are talking about chapter, well, I'm sorry, you, chapter what? What did you say? What chapter? Chapter 5, about? verse 9. What chapter? Chapter 5, verse 9. Chapter yeah, chapter five, 5, verse 90. Chapter 5, verse, verse 90. 90. Okay, tell me about it. Go ahead. Now we know what you're talking about. Go ahead. Okay, and then I'll tell you about it, but I'm following the rule because I'm, I know you you will not run away from me and we'll debate on this topic. So that's the agreement here. Okay, so let me go ahead and get the verse in chapter 5, verse 90. Okay. It says, forbidden food is uh, alcohol, any kind of intoxicants, mm -hmm. gambling. Okay. So from the study here, they pointed out that, this, that Muslim women are 50 times less likely to give birth to a fetal alcohol because of the teachings of the Quran. Now, the question is here, which you need to answer, is how is it that the Quran but, gave a better where, where, response? Where is speaking about the, the, the alcohol is bad, where it says that? No, it says, for you, forbidden is yeah. alcohol, any kind of intoxicants. But where it says, and, where it says, and it's, because bad for, of that, where it says it's bad for your health in the verse you quote for me. That is bad for your health. No, it is completely forbidden for Muslims. This is clear. Okay. And from the study thing, again. I, I, another, another, another. Is. Yeah. I, I'm asking you a very simple question. You say that this is about health. I'm asking you, why in the verse never say anything about health? It says this is from shaitan. That's all. Because it's from shaitan, don't do it, correct? Yes, this is from shaitan. And so because as a study concluded, it is the teachings of the Quran. Hmm. which caused Muslim women to abstain from alcohol. And so the question from again is that how did how could Allah of the Quran provide a better response okay. than Jesus of the Bible on the question of alcohol? That's a question you need to answer okay. now. Well, okay. And so know, this clearly... Let, let us make it clear. I'm just trying to get a full sentence from you. So are you saying the Quran confirmed that alcohol is bad no matter what? The Quranic position is that it is forbidden. Yes, no, it's no, forbidden. It's forbidden. I, I know it's forbidden. This is not a question. Are you saying that alcohol is bad no matter what? It's bad. It's ugly. Yes or no? No, 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 no. But I think these are irrelevant questions you're this asking. You're question. running away this from the, the study. This is the topic. This is the topic. I want to know if alcohol is bad or it is okay. not bad. Is it bad or not? I mean, what's wrong with you? So you are saying to me, Quran is forbidden okay. alcohol. Okay, forbidden because of what? Because it's good or because it's bad? Yeah. What? You don't understand the question. Here, I so know. I need you to take no, some time. This is my question. question. This is my question. question. This is my question. Right. This is my question, not yours. The Quran forbid alcohol. Is it because yeah. it is bad or because it's good? You're saying okay. So you're saying alcohol is forbidden. I'm Quran. Not saying, is it I because not it's bad or good? You? Why you are in trouble? Very simple question. How many times I need to repeat? Listen carefully. The Quran forbid alcohol. That's wonderful. Oh, Does the Quran forbid the alcohol because it is bad or because it's good? So the reasons why the Quran forbade, there's actually a reason in the Quran. They said there's some good that outweighs the good. Why you look at the the, and why, so why the you issue making, here. Why you are making a speech? I mean, the answer is very simple. Allah forbid alcohol because it's bad, or Allah forbid the alcohol because it's good. Which one? Choose one. I've already given you the answer. Now no, the, no, the no, issue is no, I'm going to read it no, to you. No, and you got no, I want a clear answer. Is it okay. bad or good? Is alcohol is bad or good? See, CP, I need you to stop interrupting me. I know you're scared. Stop, I know this is the point you are not able to answer. I want and one word. word. Is it bad or good? You are the one who chose the topic. Everybody is my witness. And now you don't dare to answer. What's wrong with you? Okay, Allah forbid alcohol because it's bad or because it's good. CP, 
CP, you gotta let me. Don't interrupt me. You have I'm to let me answer. Okay, we're answer. gonna have an intelligent You're making a speech. I mean, the answer is very simple. You call me. You say, according to science, proving that women they give birth and they have a, a, a defect in their birth. That's wonderful. That means alcohol is bad. So why you don't say it's bad? Is it bad or not? You know, the, the, the issue with the Quranic position on alcohol <laughs> is that there is some good in it. My friend, I want okay, you to go okay, to okay, me. Is, is it you who mentioned to me in the beginning saying that science proved that most of women who give a defect birth, the reason for defect birth, and you, you mentioned the word of Christian specifically, that the reason for that the highest percentage is yes. because of alcohol. So is alcohol is bad or good? Okay, okay. Your question, if I understand your question, you're you're saying that overall alcohol, a good or bad thing, is that your question? Even, I mean, this is even your topic, and you don't even dare to answer. You call me saying that because of drinking I, alcohol, women do give birth to children who have defect in their birth. Okay, that's your claim, and you claim this is from science. That's wonderful. Now I'm asking you, based on what you told me, is that mean? And based on the Quran forbidding the alcohol, does that mean according to Allah, alcohol is bad or good? Oh, I think I understand your question. Your your question is, okay, did Allah forbid alcohol for a specific reason of preventing fetal alcohol babies? Is what? that your question? No, no, what's wrong with you? You are in trouble. You are like a cartoon, Mickey Mouse. You are, you are in the corner. You know what to say. I'm asking you, is it bad or good? Very simple. Don't, I, tell me, don't tell me any reason. I want to know. Is alcohol, according to the Quran, bad or good? Ah, bad, bad. Okay. Did answer your question Thank it's you bad finally, but there's a little bit okay, of good in it okay, God, finally it can... you said it is bad so That's how right. come the quran says it is good here we go this is the chapter 16 verse number 67 you made me lose my voice repeating the same question the quran says that the alcohol is amazing drink is the best it's a miracle of allah read for me the verses <clears throat> Are you finding the verse? I'm sorry, I'm not even looking at your screen. Well, did you want me to respond? Oh, no, no I don't want you to respond. You can call a friend. I mean, what's wrong with you? The Quran says, you said to me, it's bad. A second ago, you, are... you said to me a second ago, the Quran says what? that the alcohol is bad. <laughs> now the Quran saying that alcohol is a great what? drink. It's even a miracle from Allah. It is a benefit for mankind. And you can change any translation you want. What translation you want to put for you on the screen? Okay. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm not even looking at your screen. So can I, let me answer that if you, if I may. Uh, okay. And one thing I will require of you, Christian, do not interrupt me in my rebuttal. Because if we're yeah, going to have an yeah, intelligent yeah, debate, yeah, we yeah, should yeah, not be interrupted. Yeah, even a rebuttal, because simply you just say that the alcohol is bad. The Quran is very saying the alcohol is amazing. I mean, can you even make a rebuttal? Yeah. Okay. So, Okay, so let me now respond to you without interruption, because if you interrupt me, this is an act of cowardice, and this is exactly what I'm saying. He can't handle me in this debate, so he's got to sure interrupt me. So let me now sure go ahead and... We cannot handle you, for sure. Okay. Have, you know, no. For sure, you are like a little bit cat. I mean, I'll answer how the Quran, the same book, saying alcohol is a sign from Allah. It's a great benefit for mankind. And this is amazing product to, to, to use. It's a benefit. You make good deeds from it. You make good money from it. You make good health from it. It is in the top of that. It's a sign from Allah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now you're gonna need to speak, or you're gonna run away. I'm waiting, for, guys. I'm waiting for your interruption. Uh, in I'm waiting for your Majesty. Stop complaining about interruption. You can do interrupt interrupt me too. We said it's a free form, and I, I, you I want, your duty. Remember your duty here. Supposedly you are going to show me your knowledge, and your knowledge is a joke. You are just a kid. You choose a topic. You okay. mentioned the topic, you, and now you do not know what to say because your God said alcohol is amazing. How you answer that? Okay, I want everybody to understand when you interrupt somebody, this is an act of cowardice. He's running away because I'm about to put this uh, put the slam uh, dunk on to him. So let me go ahead and answer the question. Mm -hmm. The issue with the Quran actually made it clear: if 
alcohol, there is some good. However, the bad is the good. So this is a, uh, this is what the Quran and the Quran and the kind of movie that just get lost, get lost, stupid idiot. It's a waste of time to talk to you. It says in the front of you, it's a good. You made good from it. You made good nourishment of it. Indeed, you made good nourishment of it. Indeed, if you have sense, indeed you are a donkey. You are a certified donkey. Obviously, you do not know your book. It's a waste of time for someone like me. I can put my toes in a chat room and you cannot answer my toes. Who are you? So when you say, I'm going to debate the Christian prince, I want to debate the Christian prince, you're a potato. Let me, yeah, the Quran says there's some benefit. What some benefit? It says, I asked you, is it bad or good? And I repeated the question a hundred times so you can think about it carefully. And then finally I made you say it. It's bad. It's bad. Chapter 16, verse number 67, Allah praise alcohol, claiming that he is the one who made it for us. It's for our benefit. So don't go around. You see, I, I, I just now, I give you like a bite. You know, like, you know, you want to bite my shoe? I give you my shoe. But as you see, even my shoe, you cannot even bite it because your mouth is so small. Potato. And if you want to talk about health and birth defect, I never saw birth defect as much in Islamic countries because you marry from your cousin. And the proof of birth defect is you. Look at you. I mean, if you are not the proof of birth defect, who is the proof? Idiot. Shall I call him back again or give him one more chance? <laughs> he will make a rebel. <laughs> uh, Why are you run away? I'm laughing. What happened? I'm, I'm, we are laughing. What happened? We, ha we have to take. A, we have to. We have to take commercial break because you are a birth defect yourself. So now, are you going okay. to answer or not? Don't 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 make an excuse. Are you going to answer how Allah He says that alcohol is a great product and he, it is a sign from Allah? And then you take it. You said to me from the beginning that it is from Satan. Is it the other verse? It says from Satan. The verse you oh, gave Christian me, the verse you gave me, chapter, chapter 5, isn't it that verse It says that alcohol is from shaitan? Okay, well, I want to make it clear, you, you hung up on me, you interrupted me, I, and this I, is a clear I, sign I, of power. Everybody is laughing. Now, listen, 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 this is recorded, everybody will <laughs> laugh at you. So, the verse in chapter, chapter 5, verse number 90, it says that alcohol is from shaitan, correct? It is a handwork of shaitan, correct? It is a handiwork of the devil which is found in your book, right? Nope. Okay, so now how the other verse is saying that it is the work of Allah? It is what? The work of Allah. What? It is the sign from Allah. It's a work of Allah. So chapter 16, verse number 67, it says, It is healthy. It is good. It's a fruit. It's amazing. It's beautiful. It's a good. It's nourishment. And it is a sign yeah. from Allah if you have any sense so how it is a sign from okay. Allah and then the other okay. chapter you gave me it says it is the work or the handwork of shaitan which one we should take absolutely and so this as you can see Christian hmm. Prince is running away from the real question tonight on how is it the Quran could give a better response now what he's showing okay but I can show internal contradiction don't cheat topic you see you know you say I hang okay. up on you don't, don't make me hang up on you because you're a kid you're just a kid literally I'm asking you the, answer, the question is very clear the question is very clear yeah. everybody is laughing at you you are a stupid like your prophet who said that the penis of the man will be endless and I'm, I'm sure you are dreaming about that because you have a problem now listen is it is it from God this alcohol or it's from shaitan? 
Okay, so as you can see, he's interrupting me. He's hanging up on me. And this is a sign of uh, uh, from Christian. Okay, Christian. Uh, give me, uh, be, I, because I'm done with you. You're done. You're, you're, you're lost. I have nothing to say. I'm just giving you extra time. Just for, you see, listen, listen. Neither Ahmed, you are here for one purpose, entertainment. You are just a joke. You are not a debater. You know nothing. What? So I'm asking you, the verse in chapter 16, verse, ch chapter 16, verse number 67, don't make me, re make me repeat myself one million time. It says that alcohol is made by Allah. It's a sign from Allah. It's a miracle of Allah. It's a great, it's amazing. And the other verse, the one you gave me, chapter 5, verse number 90, it says it's the handwork of shaitan. So which one of them is accurate? Okay, so the, one of the, the cowardice of Christian prince, anybody can win a debate by interrupting their opponent, hanging up on them, and, and shoving me. questions. You can interrupt me. Oh. You can interrupt me as much as you want. Still, you can't answer. What is the answer? What is the answer? People don't, don't care for you. You, uh, you can cry as much as you want. People are listening. Which one is made by? Made by Allah or made by the devil? Is it bad or good? I'm waiting for the answer. I told you this guy is scared to debate me. The Quran sure, makes it very sure. clear. For sure, for sure, we are scared of you, my friend. So for sure. I mean, there's no, there's no two people that when I want to debate about it. You know, my friend, everybody is scared of you. You are, you are a crazy person, brother. So now, is Shaitan okay. is the one who made alcohol or Allah? Chapter 16, verse number nine, 67, says it's made by Allah. Chapter 5, no. verse number 90, it says made by Shaitan, and it's bad. So which one of them is accurate? Okay, so the Quran does not state in Surah 16, verse 67, that the, that the uh, <laughs> alcohol was made by Allah. You have lied. Now, do not interrupt me again. Uh, what I want now, I did answer verse. this question, as you can see. I think verse. he's running read, away. Read, read the verse for us. Read, read, read the verse for us. Read the verse for Allah. Read, read, the, read, read, the, read the verse. You said it doesn't say that. Read the verse. Read the verse. I want every. I want it to be clear to everybody. He's running away. He cannot debate read, me. Read the Anybody verse, can read hear. the verse. Let us see who's running away. I mean, we are having a debate. Or I'm asking you. Give me the answer. I'll read the verse. Why? Why? You, okay. You are saying something is not there. It's in front of us. Does it say that it's a goodly provision? Okay. Let me read for you. This is the Muslim translation. Okay. And a goodly provision. Do you see the word goodly provision? Yes. Okay. That does not say. Okay. Perfect. It's Anybody can it, win it. Doesn't say what? Doesn't say, doesn't say what? Doesn't say what? Clear. Christian Prince is a coward. Is it clear? He cannot have a fair debate with equal time. He's refusing to do so. What equal it's time? Clear I'll, give you, I'll give you more time than me. I'm, I, will, I, will, I will stay mute if you're answering. I'm asking you. Does it say there? Well, it's, you said to me, I asked you, is it a bad? You said, yes, it is bad. Women, they get babies and they have defect. Bad, for sure it's bad. Okay, the Quran here says, and it's a good provision. Verily, there is in and be the sign to four people who have wisdom. So according to the chapter 16, verse number 67, the one who have wisdom is the one who drink alcohol. Okay. So, uh, can I talk, or is it just your time to... Stop, I mean, crying. Well, how are we Stop crying. I'm trying yeah. to explain to you the question, so you might answer. You are just trying to, to buy time. You do not know what to say. Go ahead. Yeah, you did lie to people, in which you said that you said alcohol is from Allah. We have you on tape. After changing your statement, oh, it's just a goodly provision. It means that there's some good in it. So now you just kind of uh, change your original statement. So yeah, you did get busted lying can here I tonight. Talk now? Can, but I talk? can I talk? Okay, you just said, you just said, okay, hold on, guys. I, I said, this is from Allah. It says that in front of you, you donkey. It says it's a sign. It's a sign. It's a miracle. Or ayat and ayat. You know what I mean? It's a miracle of Allah. Do you see the word sign? Are you a certified donkey like your prophet or you are not? You are. So it says here in the front of you, it's a sign for those who have a wisdom. The signs come from who? From God. Do you must believe that signs come from shaitan? Am I, are you going to let me talk without interrupting me? So stop so, me, so me Why you are saying we got me busted and this is not from Allah? If the verse in the front of you is saying, the verse in the front of you is saying, this is a sign from Allah. So beer is from Allah. It's a sign. Black label. Brother and Tata, we have Zebra. We have the brother, another um, with us. And by the way, the Muslim, they used to drink and they pray. And even the Quran made the verse about it, praising it. 
And then because the Arabs they start laughing at Muhammad, he said to them, Oh Muslims, Allah told me, don't pray when you are drunk. Chapter 4, verse number 43. Oh, who you believe, don't go to the prayer when you are intoxicated because you are drunk. So Zakir Naik, Nadir Ahmad, all the potatoes in the world, they used to go to the mosque with the Prophet and they fed a pot around him. And the Arab they start making fun of Muhammad and his followers. What kind of followers they are? Why Allah did not say from the beginning? And in the top of that, Allah He praised alcohol and He claimed that alcohol is a sign from Him. Why He did that? Because the Arab they love to drink. You're my. Well, there's no point of giving me the mic if you're going to interrupt me every 10 seconds. I mean, this is an act of cowardice on your I'm, part. I'm you're just answering you. I'm just answering you. You made, you made a statement. You made a statement. You said you got me busted. You said you got me busted. The verse doesn't say it's from Allah, so I have to answer. It says in the front of it's a sign from Allah. So do you agree it's a sign from Allah or not? And, there's i have never won a shouting match no, no, in my no, life there's no, a different no, listen, listen. I, I want to answer you see shouting man this is not shouting match this is spanking match you are being spanked i, I want you to tell me Coward. does it say does it say in the verse a sign from allah or not it's pointless you're just going to interrupt What's the stop, point of now talking about it? It's it's the same. Same. Here we go. Uh, it, took me, it took me five minutes repeating my question to, to make you say that alcohol is bad. Repeating my question one million times. And now you are going to do it again. So is it going? Is it saying there that alcohol is a sign from Allah or I'm lying? It, okay, so let it be clear. I'm going to answer your question. Even though you're jerking me around, Abdul, you're interrupting me. Are you going to answer sign of, is it a sign from Allah? Heart. Is it a sign from Allah or not? You see, I am not anyone you can play with. They are talking to Christian Prince. I hold you from your tail. Okay. I put you in the corner. And it doesn't matter how big the rat is in front of me. Still, you have no cheese. I'm going to repeat my question. Is it a sign from Allah as the verse saying or online? No, it does not say it's a sign from Allah. Then it says it is a sign. Then read the verse. Uh, okay. Then read the verse. Read the verse. It says the word sign there. The sign is There's a difference. <laughs> Can I respond? <laughs> Why are you so afraid to debate me, Christian Prince? Please keep in mind when you interrupt people you want that's not a debate and that's very good in the front of everybody in the front of everybody which interpretation you like to put in the screen christian prince this do turns stop into playing. it's not everybody laugh at you you want a jalalain you want a tabari you want a bikati what do you want i'll put them for you and okay. you'll get your busted you're a potato so i'm asking you for the last time i'm losing my patience you're just a kid is it a sign from christian. Allah or a sign from shaitan here it says it's a sign for those who have wisdom for who yes for the one who have wisdom yes. so the quran saying it clearly <laughs> that those who have wisdom they believe in the sign which is dream drunk <laughs> can i respond i mean can i talk i don't know you could just interrupt me for four no, seconds i think like no, 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 you're the best joker ever <laughs> i love you man i love you i love you you know god created a lot of funny things i love i love you for the sake of god because you are the best joker are you going to answer or not you see how many times i need to repeat my answer when the quran is saying it's a sign it's a sign by whom who is the one who's giving the sign can I talk? <laughs> Are you going to talk, Christian Prince? <laughs> no, no, you're not allowed to talk. I'm repeating the question, you donkey. Is it a sign from Allah? This The word sign is coming from who? Who is the one who did yes. the sign? Who is the one who did the that text? sign? Go ahead. Okay. Okay, so you're... The, now, please don't interrupt <laughs> me. The text of the Quran, it is a sign. As that it text did not say it's a sign from Allah. So the text did not say this. Okay, it's from, oh, who? It's from who? It's from who? What? Guys, it's not from Allah. Okay, no, no. Finally, we got an answer. It's it doesn't say it's no, from Allah. It's from who? Okay, Christian Prince, you are scared to debate me. It? It's very clear. Coward, don't and hang so, up and don't don't run. Don't run, coward. I'm asking you. You say it doesn't say it's a sign from Allah. So are you saying that your God He gave a sign from Shaitan, and He called it wisdom? The text said, okay, listen, I'm going to 
Well, I don't want you to interrupt me again, Christian, because it's an act of cowardice. You're scared to debate me. The issue you're tonight... Answering. You are not with... answering. You are not answering. So is it a sign from Allah or a sign from shaitan? The text doesn't say, but now I'm done with you. I'm now you, I want you... No, 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 you're not done. You are not, we just started, you donkey. Where are you going? What do you mean you're done with me? Okay. Listen, is it a sign from Allah or a sign from shaitan? Prove it to me. <laughs> Whatever you say, you have to prove it to me. What interpretation you like us to show to everybody in, in, in listening? Because either you are lying, and this is a sign from Allah, or I am lying, and it's not a sign from Allah. So when we say it's a sign... Is it a sign from Allah? You said it doesn't say that, and you said it doesn't, it's, which means it's not. So, can you get me busted, Your Majesty, Nader Ahmed, the scholar who have no, you don't have high school? Can you get me busted and show me the interpretation for the verse? Where it says this is not a uh, sign well, from Allah. Where it says this Christian, is not a sign from Allah. Christian Prince, mm -hmm. I have to go. I cannot believe you jerking me around. You have to go. Well, mommy is coming. What, you want to change your diaper? Wait. Where you want to go? Where you want to go? What happened? No, you are in the corner. You are a potato, and you are a coward. You say this. Is, you you just admitted that Allah is shaitan because the Quran is saying this is a sign for those who have wisdom, and you deny that those who follow the wisdom they are following the sign of God. You just deny that this is a sign from God by saying it doesn't say that. So you are a liar and you are a potato. This is the topic you choose. And you don't want to answer because it's very embarrassing. Let us see how many Muslims will, will laugh at you about, about, and you are the one who says, who will debate you? Who, who are you? Who are you? You don't know nothing. Here we go. I repeat again. Don't tell me I have to go. Mommy, mommy, she will be upset. She will watch this video and she will be upset from you. Be a man. Be the hero. So Wait, is, it a sign from, is it a sign from Allah or it is not? I have to go. I want you to come into a public debate with me on the top. <laughs> this is the kid, Nadra Ahmed, who go around and says he want to debate a Christian prince. <laughs> this is why they don't dare to debate me. The, this guy, last time I spoke to him, it was maybe 12 years ago. And he admit he's a prophet, have sex with the goat. That's why they want to talk about it. He said, so what? <laughs> Christian Prince, he ran away from me, Christian Prince. I mean, come on, this guy, he cannot debate me, you know, I mean, my name is not Dudu. You know, Dudu and Dudu, like Dudu, the Dudu, the Bada Duda, the Dudu, a little bit potato, you are a donkey. And this is the topic he chose. This is his choice, imagine. If this is his choice, this guy was thinking about it like he's scratching his ass for the last century. If I talk to Christian Prince, I would talk about what I would choose this topic. It's very powerful. It's an amazing topic. He cannot refute me. No. What's wrong with you? You are a potato. I lost my voice talking to you. If there's no proof that you are just, I mean, this guy, he looked like 60 years old. Thank God, otherwise the Muslim, they would claim that I'm talking to a kid. But he's a kid. <clears throat> I invite you to public debate. Are you going to do better in public debate? This is public debate. I mean, how, how public we have? We have 1,400 people watching. I invite you to public debate, okay? So... Public debate where people will, will die laughing at you. People will fall in the chair. People will sue me for dying from heart attack. Last time I had a seminar, people fell down on the ground. The guy almost he died from laughing. Laughing at your prophet. This is, alcohol is bad. And uh, yeah, okay. Uh, but it says it's a handwork of shaitan. It's bad. So how here Allah praising alcohol? Stupid. I, I, I was nice to him, but he have to go now because he's, you know he he saw what happened. You know, I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. Do you let me talk? Okay, I'm repeating the question because you are not talking. You are not giving the answer. See how they try. They claim that they can debate you. They change the topic in the speed of light. This is why you have to hold them tight. 
don't let them go. Learn how to debate. We don't debate with Abdul. We don't. We corner them. There's no debate. There's no debate with liars. Debate it have to happen between two people have honesty. Muslims, when they defend Islam, they don't defend by honesty. They ask him, the guy, his name is Mimi. Your God, Allah, have part. He said, who said so? What do you mean who said so? The Quran says so. The Hadith says so. The scholar, they say so. Who said so? And this is the same. All of them, they are the same. All of them, they are the same. Who said so? And here we ask the Muslims, how the Quran is praising alcohol in one place and making it the hand of shaitan work in different place. Very simple answer for that. In the beginning, Muhammad was trying to tempt the Arab who loved to drink. He said, this is a sign from Allah. It's a good provision for you. Drink as you wish. It's a miracle for those who have wisdom. And then when later, when he noticed that people are laughing at his, him and his followers because they are a bunch of lousy, lousy, lousy people, drunk people, going to the mosque and they are falling apart. He made a verse, uh, hey brother, sisters, when you go to the mosque, brother, don't pray and you are intoxicated because beer is haram. Actually, he did not say it's haram. He says, it's, it's, don't pray when you are drunk. Okay, how, how in the world they can pray then? Because in order not to be drunk, you have to give them time. The Muslims, they have to pray five times a day. What time is going to be when you are drunk? They are drunk all the time. And Muhammad himself, he used to teach Muslims how to make alcohol. There's tons of reference about it. Good provision? No, Abdul, it says Sakaran. Sakaran, don't give me good provision for the grape. No, it's not, it doesn't say grape, my friend. First of all, it says from the grape, from the fruits and the grape, you made alcohol. Stupid. So good provision is not the grape. The good provision is from the alcohol. <laughs> it says, and you make from the fruits and the date and the, the palm date and the grape. You made from them stronger drink of alcohol. And it is a good provision for you. وَتَتَّخِذُونَ مِنْهُ سَكَرًا وَرِزْقًا حَسَنًا إِنَّ ذَلِكَ لِآيَةٍ لِقَوْمٍ يَعْقُلُونَ It's a, a sign, a miracle from Allah. And if you go to the interpretation, you will see the interpretation saying, yeah, this is before, before Allah, He forbid the alcohol. But how it's a good provision, and you make even good money from it. It says, Rizqan, Rizqan, do you know what Rizqan? And he make it Rizqan Hasanan. I don't make interpretation, we can go and read the interpretation, shall we? Oh, Muhammad Saeed, let us, let us give you the microphone of Nadir Ahmad, do you like to call me? <laughs> we offer him to show the interpretation he refused maybe you can do better can you do you like to call me or you are just a potato in the chat And now the Muslim they try to say, oh, this is not about you know alcohol. It says clearly, and you make from it. What do you make from it? You make alcohol. And then right away it says good provision. So what we made from it? Something good, a good provision. So they can say whatever they want to say. The Quran is appraising alcohol, claiming it's a sign from Allah. Is it the grape sign from Allah? No. It's alcohol who make you go drunk. Anyone? Anyone next?
Uh, if Allah he care for not to have a birth defect for children, then he should forbid you from having sex with your own daughter, as the Quran chapter 25 verse number 54 says. We go to the interpretation, it says, it's not forbidden for you to have sex with your daughter and the mother of your daughter if she is a daughter from adultery. So the Quran forbid you from having sex with your daughter if she is daughter from marriage, but if she is not, it's okay. If the Quran care not to have birth defect, he should not allow you to marry your first cousin. It's the same blood. So when you speak about people who drink alcohol, there's nowhere in Christianity it says, you go drink as you wish. Jesus said, little bit of it, little. Bless your heart. And according to science, even doctors, they give a medication, drink a little bit of alcohol, a little bit, if you have a heart issue. And you can search it right now on Google. God, he cursed those who do something against his will. He punished them. If people get drunk, this is their business. If people commit sin, this is their business. In Islam, your God, he promised you, we did not even go to the second topic, which is the same topic. If alcohol is bad, how come Allah, he promised you to be in heaven? If alcohol is the handwork of shaitan, then how Allah is going to import alcohol to his heaven? Allah will call shaitan, and will ask him, can I buy some alcohol from you? As you see, it's the handwork of shaitan. But the Quran, he promised that every Muslim he go to the heaven, he will have rivers of the handwork of shaitan, rivers of wine. Not one bottle of wine, which means drink as much as you want. So how it is the handwork of shaitan, yet it's made and it's, it's a, it, it is going to be sent to the heaven. So made by shaitan, bought by Allah. Say you will not be drunk in heaven. So what does that mean? Fake wine? <laughs> guys, guys, look, Muhammad Saeed, he give you the answer. It says you will not be drunk in heaven, brother. What does that mean? Allah will import fake wine? Either it's called wine or it's not. So obviously it's called wine khamr from Tahammara. So it is a wine and it, it is an alcohol. So if you are saying to me that it's an alcohol will not make you drunk, that's mean it's not alcohol. Allah is faking it. He bought it from maybe China. No. Allah will not make you drunk, brother. It's not an excuse. It's a handwork of shaitan. How it is the handwork of shaitan, it is evil. Then in different verse, chapter 7, 16, praising it, and the Muslim will try to find solution. Like you, he says, oh, he's talking about the grape. It says it clearly, from the grape and in the pond that you made alcohol. And from it, you take a good provision. What is the topic? is what you made it from the grave, not the grave, because the grave is not a grave no more. When you make alcohol, there's no grave, that's it. The grave became alcohol. So the good provision coming from the alcohol, and he's saying it's a it's a sign from Allah. Why? Muhammad trying to explain how somebody drinks some wine, and he loses his mind. He says this is a sign from Allah. Even getting drunk is a sign from Allah. So getting stupid will make you, you know, this is a sign from Allah too. And you know what? If Allah will bring you, give you alcohol, you can, it doesn't make you drunk. 
so he took alcohol from it that is a cheating and what and why he why he promised you wine i mean what's wrong what what wine for what the obsession with the wine in the heaven what exactly the wine for then hmm? why if we go to the heaven of allah there's okay if we go to this verse i'll just show you the heaven of allah contain few things for sure six is number one part of them but let us see you are sitting now in the heaven of allah what allah will provide to you number one thing there's a garden enclosed and the grave vines next to it there's big boobs read he don't even say women he said big boobs even the word women is not there so big boobs of what a cow what kind of God he described heaven to you and he says there's a grape and those grape will come to you okay and big boobs I mean do you see the flight of thought what the connection what is the connection between the grape and the big boobs You see, when you say grape, you say grape, uh, apple. Okay, that makes sense. I mean, you are counting for me fruit. But you say there's a grape uh, vine trees and then big boobs. What does this have to do with this? What is the connection? <clears throat> hmm? Any Abdul? Sayyid is saying, go to the Tafsir. Okay, Sayyid, why you don't call me so we go to Tafsir? And I will make you die laughing. When a Muslim, they explain something, they confuse you more. Do you dare to call me? Do you dare? <clears throat> hmm. Who is next? Anyone? Let us see if there is any other Muslim. If you are a Christian, don't send me messages saying debate this guy and debate that guy. Any Christian who send me a text message in prayer talk, I'm going to block you because you are just wasting waste my time going over text I don't need to read. Okay. All right. Look like we have zero Muslim. Poor, poor Nader Ahmad. Anyone? Actually, there's some hadith Muhammad he said proving to us that Muhammad is mentally ill. Kamar is made from five things. Date, wheat, uh, barley, honey, and grapes. <laughs> <laughs>
but the Quran is praising alcohol and saying it's a good provision for you and the Muslim they try their best they say oh no here the provision is the grape yeah. but he's make he's saying clearly you make from this alcohol this is what you make from it and he called it good provision so if he's talking about the grave or sorry the, the grape he will not mention what come out of it calling it good provision what come of it is good that's why okay if alcohol if alcohol is bad what is the good provision then is coming out of it why is mentioning the word sakaron tattakhiduna minhu sakaron you get drunk from it warizqan hasanan and you and good provision okay and this is a sign for those who believe or they have wisdom so what is the wisdom to notice what Allah he gave you that you can make from the grape from the palm date a good provision alcohol it's a sign from Allah anyone <clears throat> and then you will notice that this verse by the way is forbidden later because if it's about it's abrogated if this is about grape a grape never be abrogated you can always eat a grape you will see the Muslims and their interpretation saying this is before this verse was abrogated so what is abrogated about it that alcohol is a good provision how you can how you can abrogate a verse saying alcohol sorry grape is good you ask any Muslim they say no we can eat grape so what is abrogate about it if this is about a grape what abrogated about it is the verse praising alcohol Any Abdul? Anyway, I think we have enough for today. So you guys can download this video and let uh, <coughs> uh, Nader Ahmad, who he have to go. Uh, he have to go, I mean, you know, he have to go. Hmm. Yeah, see, there's many hadith about this story here. Let us see. Anyone? Last call. Any Muslim? Mayday, mayday. All right, Muslim, I leave you with the big boobs of Allah. Close your eyes. Imagine yourself now in the heaven of Allah. There's big grape, vein, vine around you, and big boobs. Brother, it's time to remember the gifts of Allah, the pooby God. The booby God who nobody can compete with him. The God who made miracle, he make you get a drunk. It's a sign from Allah. You were not drunk an hour ago, and now you are speaking words. Nobody knows what you mean. It's a sign. Black label sign very beautiful anyway thank you very much for being here may the lord bless you and we will see you soon again don't forget to subscribe if you did not subscribe and if you subscribe don't forget to unsubscribe 
because Allah, according to Allah religion, Allah will double the bad, the good deed. You know, he, so you do bad deed, and then you made a good deed, and then Allah erase your bad deed, and He give you the deed. So let me explain to you, Muslim, why you need to subscribe to me. Subscribing to me, it's a bad deed. Then you unsubscribe. Then Allah will erase the bad deed, and you will win two good deeds, brother. Keep doing this all day long. By the end of the day, you will make millions of deeds for free. Unbelievable. Actually, before I start the video today, I saw a commercial of Muslim that was saying, the Prophet says that the one who build the, who build the mosque, Allah will build the house for him in heaven. <laughs> True story. Thank you very much. God is good. And pray for the Muslims. We love them. We don't hate them. But we hate lies and we hate deception. We are against deception. Deception is our enemy. It's not the Muslims. Muslims are poor people. We pray for the Muslim to see the truth and the truth will set them free. The Lord, he says, I am the truth. I am the life. I am the light. I am the beginning. I am the end. I am the Alpha. I am the Omega. Who he believe in me, he will never die. He who, who believe in me, he will live. We invite you Muslims to live with the Holy God, not with the perverted prophet. Come to Messiah. He is the only Savior, no one else. His name is holy. His act is holy. His word is holy, and he is holy. And even in the Quran, in chapter 19, verse 19 says, the Holy Son. And the question is, Jesus is the Holy Son of who? Even his birth is a miracle. Not only him is a miracle. What an amazing person to follow. The Messiah. Holy is your name. And holy who you are. And your holy is what we seek. God bless you. And see you soon again. Christ is Lord. Islam is false. And thank you very much.